Hey guys, I'm Aria. I'm a junior studying mechanical engineering, and today I'm going to be asking the director of undergraduate admissions some questions about himself. Hey, hey do you mind if we ask you some questions? Yeah, I'm actually running to a meeting, so. Can we join you? Yeah, absolutely. Awesome. Okay. Um, so, how are you doing today? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm really good. Um, do you mind telling us who you are? Yeah, well, my name is Paul Ledesma. I'm the director of undergraduate mm -hmm. admission, but, but you know that. I did know that. You're right. Um, where are you from? Uh, originally from Irvine, California. Cool. And what does the director of undergraduate admissions do? Uh, well, uh, I am responsible for recruiting and enrolling our undergraduate engineering population here. So that's working with high school students mm -hmm. and prospective transfer students from other colleges and universities. Cool. What's the most rewarding part of this job? Uh, the most rewarding part is meeting all the students. You know, you, you develop a relationship with them and their parents, you get them to enroll, and then you get to work with them throughout their whole time here all the way through graduation. That sounds really cool. Yeah, I like it. What's the most taxing part? The same thing. Uh, but, but it, you know, admission is a lot of like a 24-7 job and that students have right. questions and it's their livelihoods and their lives at hand and they're concerned about things so you got to make sure that you're answering questions over email and social media and just make sure you're available to students. That makes sense. Yeah. Where did you go for your undergrad? I came here. Really? Yeah, fight on. Fight on. Um, what was your favorite thing about it? Uh, I love just meeting all the different people here. I made some of the best friends here. As a matter of fact, most of the people in my life today uh, are in my life mostly because of USC, which is, oh. I didn't never, never thought that would actually happen. But. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Um, so why did you pick USC in the first place? Uh, I picked USC mostly because, well, I, A, I had no idea where I wanted to go or what I wanted to do, but when I came onto campus at USC, it just spoke to me. There was a spirit here, there was a vibe here, there was a tenacity to the people, and it just matched who I wanted to be. And so I, I think I picked right. I liked it. I've been here for a long time, so as a result, it yeah. worked out. <laughs> it, it, that's kind of like my USC experience, but not like the long time part, because I've only been here for three years, yeah. you know. Yeah. Um, do you mind if I ask you some questions about undergraduate admissions? I don't mind. Let's do it. Awesome. So what do you think is the coolest thing about Viterbi that sets it apart from other I think it's because when students study engineering here, they have the opportunity to study other things. It's what we call engineering plus, so they can study you know, cinema classes and art classes and music classes and film. Whatever it's going to be, they can study whatever they want on top of engineering and really make a, a really enhanced uh, part of their education. Plus, it's incredibly diverse. I mean, our last incoming class was the most diverse ever with 44% women and 24% historically underrepresented minorities. So, it's a cool place. Yeah, I agree. I love it. So, I agree. Um, what do you think the ideal applicant looks like? Well, there's no such thing as the ideal applicant because every single student that we admit uh, has been admitted for a different reason than the person before them. We need them to be prepared, obviously. They need to do well in math and science classes in addition to everyone else in high school. Mm -hmm. But we want a lot of different unique individuals here to make up a really well-rounded class, meaning lots of different types of people. So there is no such thing as an ideal applicant. That makes sense. So then do you have any advice for first-year applicants? For first-year applicants, I think the best advice is to go into that application and try to be as authentic as possible, not try to strategize it or write down what they think we're looking for, but to make sure that we're going to uh, make sure that we understand who they are and how they communicate it well. Do you have any advice for your transfer applicants? For transfer applicants, is to make sure that they take the right classes that we ask them to take, mm -hmm. math classes, calculus classes, uh, lab-based science classes, to take those classes as we're asking them to do and they don't need to do anything else, but just make sure they're doing the well with those, the strong thing to be prepared for our programs. That makes sense. Do you think there is a best major? I think I'd get in trouble if I picked a best major. Uh, they're all really great and uh, honestly, if we had a competition, I don't think anyone would ever win. I think you're probably right. Is there anywhere that students can go to learn more about USC and Viterbi specifically? Absolutely. We have our website, viterbiadmission.usc.edu, and mm -hmm. your guys' website, viterbivoices.usc.edu. True. Check it out. It's a good website. <laughs> They both work really well. Student blogs and all of our admission information is in there as well. Awesome. Um, okay. Um, that's all I got. Do you have any questions for me? Uh, my only one question is, do you think that people actually believed I was going to a meeting? And the second question is, do, you, do they know that we just went to Big Circle? I don't know. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> all right. See you.